welcome to the Medical Terminology Podcast on iTunes U at JCCC. This episode is Chapter 2, Part 3, The Glands. So far in the podcast, we've been focusing on the building blocks of the body, and there are three major building blocks, the organs, tissues, and glands. We've looked at cytology, which is the study of cells, histology, the study of tissues. Gland is a specialized group of cells that form secretions. And there are two types of glands. What is the type of gland, such as a sweat gland, that secretes chemical substances into ducts that either lead to organs or out of the body? That's the exocrine gland. E-X-O-C-R-I-N-E. Exo means out of, and these are the type of glands that have ducts. Now what's the type of gland that does not have a duct and that makes secretions directly into the bloodstream? Well, that's the endocrine gland. E-N-D-O-C-R-I-N-E. Endo again means within. Now there's a word part that refers to glands, and that word part is aden. The combining form is adeno, A-D-E-N slash O. And so pretty much any pathology or procedure relating to gland is going to use the combining form, adeno. There are some pathologies and procedures in the chapter, and these all use the suffixes you learned in chapter 1. So. These should be really easy for you to learn as long as you remember those suffixes. That's why, again, those suffixes are so important because they're going to appear again and again. So I'm going to quiz you over these and let's see if you can come up with them. Okay, first of all, what is the term that would mean the surgical removal of a gland? Well, that would be adenectomy. A-D-N-E-C-T-O-M-Y. Adeno means gland, and ectomy means surgical removal. What is the term for the abnormal hardening of a gland? Well, that's adenosclerosis. A-D-E-N-O-S-C-L-E-R-O-S-I-S. Again, adeno means gland, and sclerosis means abnormal hardening. What is the term for a benign tumor of glandular origin? That's adenoma, A-D-N-O-M-A. Again, adeno means gland. The suffix oma refers to a tumor. And in this case, the benign tumor means it is not life-threatening. What is the term for the abnormal softening of a gland? That's adenomalacia, A-D-E-N-O-M-A-L-A-C-I-A. And again, adeno means gland, and malacia means abnormal softening. What would be the term for any abnormal disease condition of a gland? Adenosis, A-D-E-N-O-S-I-S. Again, remember, osis means abnormal condition. What is the term for the inflammation of a gland? That's adenitis, A-D-E-N-I-T-I-S. Again, adeno means gland, and itis means inflammation. Okay, well, that's basically it for the glands. Now, the last building block they talk about here in the book near the end is the organ and the body systems. And in the following chapters, we're going to be going over each one of these individually. In fact, the table shows you the chapter that each body system's in. You should know the names of these body systems and what they do. That is what the major functions are. 
you don't need to really worry about the structures at this point. You're going to be learning those and the word parts for them in the chapters that are coming up. But you should at least know what the body systems are and what their functions are. And this ends this episode of the Medical Terminology Podcast.